Hello everyone and welcome back to some Enter the Gungeon. Hunter time. Again. Let's get right into it. No playing around this time. All of our runs end in failure. All of our runs usually end in failure. So this time... It's super fucking serious try hard mode. Oh yeah. Super serious try hard mode. Come on. Decent chest. Pick it up. What is it? Ballistic boot. Speedier than a bullet. Movement speed is increased. There we go. Shoot the guy in the face. Shoot the guy in the face. That's how we play the gungeon. Gungeon doesn't want to play by your rules. We play by the gungeon's rules. Shoot him in the face. Dodge. Shoot him in the face. Shoot him in the face. These guys all in their faces. Okay, I think that was the best option. Even though we might have wasted that blank. I'd rather not take chances. Now we gotta find more people to shoot in the face. Uh, I think this right here. Shoot you in the face, Mr. AK. They're all dead. They're all dead inside of me. There we go. We still killed them. Even though they're already dead. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. But so far, so good. We got repaid that blank back that we used. No taking chances. Taking no chances. I might take a chance, depending on the situation. If it's a situation where either, I don't know, I don't know. I, I will take some chances, depending. And that is not how you take the chance. Hey, Mr. Blue Shotgun, you're dead. Shoot you in the face. Shoot the bullet can in the face. Come on. What you think you're doing? You can't shoot me. You're trying to rush me? You can't just sneak up. You can't just do that, try to rush me like that. Do you know who I am? I'm the shittiest gungeoneer ever. You can't fuck with the shittiest gungeoneer. There we go, even though we're in, at half of our ammo already. We're at half of our ammo. But it's all okay. Okay. Hmm. Gotta come back over here. Get that red heart. Oh, that half a heart. Increases our chance of surviving. Back to shooting people in the fucking face. With our crossbow. Nope, nope. Not gonna shoot these guys in the face. Because they're tricky. I don't shoot the guys in the face that are tricky. You never know. Mailbox. We just had that last episode. Uh, uh, we explored this whole room already. Well, this whole, whole floor. Did we get ballistic boots? Yeah. Ballistic boots, speedier than a bullet. Open that shit up with the clutch dodge roll. 
We get the Magnum. Magnum PI is a big pickup for us. Ah, uh, should we get... No, we can't even afford the Winchester. So how about we just pick up a key. Save that for the next floor. And use our Magnum PI. To shoot the twins in the face. The Magnum. This is my Magnum open. Magnum has exceptional damage. What am I saying exceptional for? It's fucking amazing. Because the smaller enemies just spawn. And we kill the first one before they... Well, the... One of the bullets. One of the twins before they could spawn even. There we fucking go! Shield of the Maiden unlocked. Fuck yes. Our first flawless. That is what I'm talking about. Moonscraper. Shield of the Maiden has joined the shootout. First chamber flawless. Magnum! The Magnum is the way to go. Come on, let's just get down to the next floor already. Try out this moon scraper, see if it's good enough. That's alright. Definitely get an ammo for the Magnum. Okay, the Moon Scraper does have a major potential just because you can easily deal with enemies like that from a long range. Our first flawless. I'm happy about that. So let's just keep on going. I think we should be able to get past the second floor. Depending on the Magnum still performs amazing like it has been. Keep shooting people in the face. Taste my laser, bitch! Moon scraper! It's pretty damn good for long range, um, room clear. Its damage output is a little bit weak, but what it makes a it makes up for that in the range. And that it can rebound off of the walls. We get a heart and ruby bracelet. Their own guns explode. <clears throat> I don't think we'll get that, but we'll open up this chest. White Guan Stone. Oh, we get an additional blank on every floor. Fucking nice. Okay, Moon Scraper. Even though we're almost out of ammo for it, I'm gonna keep using it until it's completely out. Then probably switch to the crossbow. Okay. Took a stupid hit.
Okay, so far so good. Let's just go back and get that HP. Because the HP is going to save our ass in the end. I mean, we have a pretty strong run right now, too. Plus, especially with that Flawless, I'm still surprised we managed to do that. The Magnum is the best. Okay. Wait! I didn't mean to do that. Um... Fucking moon scraper ammo. A room clearing weapon is back! Okay. Now we can clear rooms pretty damn good from a far enough range. We got a third blank now. Really hoping for some more... At least another half a heart. Oh no. Ah, it's this guy. I think... Oh. You have one of these guys, too, with you. Do you? Wasn't the best. There we go. Disappointed I have to I had to use the Magnum for that, but I think it would be better. It was better than just risking it a bit. How did that hit me? No clue. Let's just ignore it. He's not really selling any HP, but the the Lichy trigger finger, gonna pick that up. Aha, uh -huh. let's find us a cell key now, shall we? We need a cell key, and soon. Um, fuck this room. Not even gonna attempt it. Attempting that will be my death. Okay. Okay. Proud of our first floor. Flawless, and I'm surprised I did not get hit from that. Okay, let's just go look for the key. saying we better get the cell key. But we didn't. What did we get? Light gun. Holy shit. That seems like it can be good. Okay, so what do we trade into the gun muncher? I'm actually thinking just the crossbow. Crossbow and Moon Scraper. This is we really don't need it anymore. We use it enough for room clear. And what do we get? The M1911. Take that half heart. I say the best thing to do is just try to fight the boss. If we can beat the boss, may hopefully we'll get a cell key. Oh, the bull holster.
I love this fucking NES light gun. Fuck. Come on. Fuck! And that's how you fuck up a pretty damn good run. Well, we didn't have that much HP to begin with anyways, towards the end, but still a pretty decent run. We finally flawless the boss, got some decent items. But yeah, I think I'm going to cut the video off here, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and subscribe for more content. I'll see you all next time.